Hello and welcome to Shop Mesa, where we highlight and feature local Mesa businesses. This is a show underwritten by ShopMesaAZ.org with the express purpose of promoting Mesa businesses and encouraging Mesa residents to shop Mesa. We're working to build a better Mesa. Hi, I'm Jackson Wright. Today I'm here with Chuck Danielson, the owner of Envision Auto Body. Thanks for being with us today. Thank you for having us. Can you tell us about how Envision Auto Body got started here in Mesa? In 1994, we bought an existing business from a relative, uh, family owned and operated since 1975. Uh, started up on Main Street and grew, and in 2001 we opened up this location, uh, 28,000 square feet under one roof. Wow, so yeah, you have both locations? Yes, we do. Great. Okay, so I'm a customer, I need my vehicle repaired. Could you take me through the Envision Auto Body process of getting my vehicle repaired? You come in and the girls take all your information to decide what insurance company because each insurance company has different techniques different estimating platforms that they use from there we have different estimators that would go out with you look go over your vehicle see what needs to be done uh, at that point come back in we could have you sign all the papers that need to be signed we could get you set in a rental car uh, and you'd be on your way. So you guys take care of the rental and everything right here? We take care of everything right here. That's great. Could you show me the rest of the facility? That'd be great. Let's great. go. All right. All right, Chuck, so I've left my vehicle in your hands. I'm gone. What happens next? Okay. The vehicle was checked in. We check each vehicle in. It's dispatched from the foreman. Parts are ordered. Now it comes into this department. The vehicles are torn down. Any additional damage that is found after teardown, it's, it's gone back over with the estimator. A new game plan is reached, new parts are ordered, and then we can actually start the repair process. Structural, whatever needs to be done, framework, everything's done in this department. So there's a lot of things that could have happened to the vehicle that they didn't see at the, at the beginning, at the outset. Correct. There's all, always hidden damage with, with plastic covers and everything. Uh, there's hidden damage underneath there. So once the vehicle is completely dismantled in the damaged area, then you know another estimate is basically oh, okay. generated. Great. So from there, it goes uh, up onto the frame racks. Uh, the structure is, you know, pulled, pulled and repaired, mm -hmm. and then the new panels can be welded on. And from there, it goes to the paint department. Okay, Jack. So you mentioned a little bit about framework. This is where that happens. Tell us about this process. This is one of the frame racks. Uh, we have an electronic measuring device, Shark. Uh, each vehicle has its own blueprint. You might want to call it. Uh, the machine's hooked up, we can measure within one millimeter uh, how close the unibody is to, to factory specs. Okay, now unibody, what's unibody? Unibody is one unitized body, basically. Okay. You had frame, and now, now you have unibody. A uh, frame vehicle is the body is set on a frame, like a, like a truck. Mm -hmm. You have the frame. Uh, unibody, all the cars now do not have frames, it's, it's just one unitized metal all together. Okay, so this, this machine here does all that and straightens it and gets yes, it all it, back to Yes, it them. clamps it. We clamp the car down on there so we can pull. Uh, then we have the measuring system underneath uh, to, to different points to where we can measure. Pull the unibody back into the factory specs, do the repairs that are necessary, making sure that you know it's back to the where it needs to be. Great. Okay, so what's next? From here, it uh, goes back into the body department. They get the assembly to where it's ready for paint, and then it goes to the paint department. All right, let's check out the paint department. Let's go. All right, Chuck, so here we are at the paint department. What happens here? Okay, the car comes over from body. Uh, we spray every vehicle with a spray mask okay. that protects the area of the car that's not getting painted okay. from overspray and any chemicals that we use. At that point, we do all the prep work, paint, uh, priming, uh, sanding, blocking, getting the vehicle ready for the paint. It's then masked up and then put into the paint booth. Uh, we, we have a computerized uh, color matching system. Uh, every vehicle comes with a code. We take that code. It may have up to seven different variances of that color. Oh, wow. uh, we then take the variance deck, go out to the vehicle or go over the vehicle, figure out which is the best color for that. Mix that up, do a spray out, make sure that everything looks good. At that point, it's into the booth and being painted. So what if maybe the color isn't quite exactly what it was, what we thought it was? Well, we can, we can tint the paint okay. uh, when we're doing the spray outs. If it, if it might be a little more metallic or a little less metallic, the metallics can be either you know, real brilliant or, or not. 
uh, we can change that in, in tinning the color. Okay, great. So it's going to match and that's, that's perfect. It's yes, it's going to match. All right, Chuck, so the vehicle just came out of paint. It's all done. What happens next? Okay, vehicle comes back to the body department. Body tech will go ahead and reassemble, uh, put the door handles, all the moldings, everything back on. Okay. At that point, then, if there's any mechanical work that's related to the accident, it'll come to the mechanical department. So you not just fix the vehicle's outside, you guys go through the mechanical part of it, the engine and everything else, and you can do that? Yes, anything that's accident related. If, if we pulled the motor or needed to pull the motor and mm -hmm. transmission to get to the unibody and structure, you know, we can do that here. We do all the oh, computer wow. work, all the airbag work. If your airbags deploy, we have a guy on site here that does all our mechanical work. Uh, wheel alignments, uh, after everything is done, uh, four wheel alignments done, make sure that it's going to, you know, go straight down the road. Great, that's fantastic. All right, what's next? After that, it's detailed, washed, and vacuumed, and brought up to the QC department. It's looked over in that department, and then you're called and said it's ready to go. So Chuck, I guess here we have a final vehicle. Yeah, we're in the QC department, quality control. At this point, the vehicle has been washed, it's been cleaned. Uh, we have a checklist that we have to go over. Uh, every vehicle is checked for, you know, your lights working, make sure that there's no warning lights on the dash. Uh, everything's back to working order, door locks, everything in, it, that's related to the accident is checked out. And at that point, uh, the estimator calls you and says your vehicle is ready to be picked up. All right, Jack, well, we're back where we started here. And uh, so my car's finished. What happens next? Okay, your car's finished, you come in. We have some paperwork for you to go over. We give you a receipt. We give you a warranty, lifetime warranty on all the repairs oh, wow. that we've done, uh, which includes the paint, everything. Uh, you check your vehicle out, make sure everything's to your satisfaction. Sign up, you're done, you get your paperwork, and you're on your way. That's great. Well, Chuck, thank you so much for taking us through the Envision Auto Body process. I really appreciate you it. You learned a lot problem. about your business here, and uh, we appreciate you guys being here in Mesa serving the East Valley. Could you tell us how we get in contact with you? Okay. We're located at 4134 East Valley Auto Drive. Okay. That's Greenfield and Highway 60, okay. kind of behind the Sportsman's Warehouse over by the DMV. Mm -hmm. uh, real easy to get to. We're also up on 5026 East Main Street, just west of Higley on the north side of Maine. Okay. Do you guys have a website? EnvisionAutobody.com. Great, Chuck. Thank you so much. I appreciate your time. You bet. Thank you.